day in my life. Yeah, that's right. Welcome back. It's me, Terry Hon. Well, today, it's kind of like doing the final while of the right? But however, it's a bit different though. Uh, well, not much different. It's the same thing anyway, doing wire lifting, lifting the wires up. But it's just different with the um, posts. Today there, I'm um, just kind of um, doing the wallet thing on steel posts. Yeah, so it's just a bit different than wooden posts. So like, um, kind of have to be, um, well, it's not that hard to put as well. Plus this block here, the vineyard itself, still like, um, I just got like it's still like uh, maybe a year or two. Um, yeah, so it's not that big, the plant, but it's very um, healthy though. Look at how, um, yeah, the plants are very healthy, like maybe two, three years max or something. Yeah, trying just to like, um, they already produce some fruits there as well. Well, the way you can know if it's uh, still young or not, see the trunk, oh, well, not the trunk, the, um, the, the size of the vines itself, like it's still young and still um, thin. Normally, you see the bigger and thicker as well, so you know it's, it's you know, like, oh, yeah, on the other side there, um, it was, um, yeah, see, it's still young vines, yeah, so you know this is, um, the one on the left side, yeah, it's still young, but the one on the right hand side before, is still, yeah, this just the, yeah, older one, so like, yeah, <clears throat> but anyway, I'm going back to this, well, um, because the way we do it here, so like, um, for example, um, the morning before we start work, Okay, Johan, you be doing, um, I don't know, I'm just putting the top of my head, like, I don't know, uh, 10 rows, it's 11 rows, you know, but however, because this is the outside row, what I mean by that, like, so if you start from number one, so like, um, of course, you know, it's different, the the young vine ones, the yen to one, the older ones, yeah, so for example, Johan, I'm going to put you on number one, yeah, so like the one, um, I'm doing the outside one, so like, it's going to S one row. So if I do this outside and the inside, yeah, there's one row. But if I do the other one as well, then there's two rows, you know. But then again, yeah. <clears throat> so I know it's a bit um if you're still new and you don't know how it works. So like yeah, it's a bit um complicated. Well, once you get used to it, you're not really it's not really like yeah, it's this very very straightforward thing. Um <clears throat> so like yeah for so that is one of the um things as well. And secondly, um when you're in the row, right? Um, so um, make sure that um, well, I would normally bring like 1.5 liter bottles of water. Um, uh, maybe I'll take um, four of them or something. So like, yeah, so uh, leave one out and put it to like what well, before I, I do 10 rows. I will put it on the third row on the post, but at the beginning of the row. So that way I don't, um, uh, so when I, so I got up, coming back down, that is one lap, right? So, um, so I just put it into like two or three ahead of where I am at now. So when I, by the time I come back, I can drink the water and then go back in again. Cause you do not want to, um, when you do the, 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 the work, you do not want to, in the middle of the row, then you're like, oh, I'm thirsty, I want to get some water. Ah, nah, does that work like that? I thought it's gonna be like wasting time going to the beginning of the row and go back and again. Yeah, yeah, so might as well finish the rows first and then you have a drink at the beginning of the row. Yeah, so that way it'll be easier for you as well. You don't get really thirsty. So, like, yeah, for here, for example, see um, the clip as well. There are some missing clips on the steel post. So, what I did, because it's um, number, I think they go one, two, three, four four or five nails here so they got number five clipping on number five and number three so if it was missing clips on number five the top first ones um so i just have to figure something out if there's the um clips below there's not used i take that out and put it on the top so that way i can clip it <laughs> you know or or you got the number three um but it's missing so i just take the one from the bottom put all the way up, I'll put on number three, so that way, you know, it's all steady, and yeah, you know, like, otherwise, if you don't click it, clip it on the, um, into the clip, yeah, otherwise it's gonna get loose and stuff, I like the, um, the wires, and it just looks so bad, so I'm like, just trying to do my best as well, <clears throat> but look at the, um, going back to the, 
producing of the vines. Like, look at those um fruits here. Like, it's see, oh, I'm oh, sorry, I just started like this here. I had to put on the top missing um clip, so I just put the bottom one, go all the way up. So, that way, you know, it'd be easier. So, it's not like, like missing clips that's on the top, but like, yeah, um, well, there's the um cutoff point there as well. This one goes straight down because there's a windmill in the middle of this row. So I think one, two, three. So they take the space out. The reason why they take um take the middle out because of the the space for a tractor to go earn, you know, to yeah, and the space for them to yeah, just a gap. So there was easier for them, for the growers to have like clean up. You okay, know, sorry. Um, when they need to trim it or whatever, you know, click. Um, fix the windmill or have something broken they can just go through it there's a space for them to park the car there so like here yeah, so yeah but anyway going back again to this job so I've done the outside row now I'm going inside the row but yeah so like okay, so this is the inside of the outside row so for example this is number one so this is number one from the inside so I'm the number one and number two if you, if you know what I mean like so like yeah but that way um <clears throat> you don't get confused yeah so you need to do both sides so like yeah but then <clears throat> well, you see there, I did the same thing again before, uh, missing the top one and just take the bottom ones out and put it all the way up, so it doesn't get missing here. So this outside, see the um, the chute was outside the wires need to be need to, need to be inside, because those canes there could be used for pruning as well, you know. Um, so, well, um, I don't know if we're gonna be doing this um block for pruning because um there'll be other contractors as well, but uh yeah so. Hopefully we do this blocks for pruning this year, which is like, I don't know, May or we're June. I think probably around May-ish this year pruning, just right after harvesting, after they're all harvested. And then um, most of the convenient owners, um, they want to get the block done as soon as possible, depending on year. But, you know, you need to catch up as well, like um, to see how um, the progress of how fast you are. You can do, you know, like, yeah. And then yeah, but um, hopefully we're gonna get this block to do pruning. It's very straightforward. It just that again, I can't stress enough to um point that out. Sometimes you know, you, you have people that um, have big numbers of people, but have no experience. Yeah, those yeah, we have to watch out for those people as well, like because normally they just come in and they just butcher the blocks up. Like, are you sure that you are a freaking pruner? <laughs> Because, like, yeah, if they, yeah, I don't know. Um, just really bad that if we, you know, if we had to come back and do the block to cut the next, the, um, the following year, it's going to be harder for us because it's going to be like, they already stopped it up in the beginning. Yeah, I know. This contractor who did this, like, <laughs> very bad though. So it's not even that funny. But, like, oh, yes, we've got numbers, bring people in. But they're all inexperienced and they just put it to places up. Yeah, even the grower, the manager knows as well, like, oh yeah, the printers is not that great. <laughs> um, sorry, well, well, that is what it is, though. Um, so if you guys do um, have any other questions and stuff regarding about working in the vineyard, so let us know and just leave a comment. Um, don't be shy, just smash those buttons there, like, likes, comments, and if you want, put them on favorite as well, and then, you know, save it for later, or whatever, you need. but make sure that you follow as well. So, like, yeah, thanks for watching there, guys. I hope you all have a great day and um, yeah, thanks for watching. If you guys got any other questions regarding to this uh, clips, don't be shy, just smash those buttons likes comments um also comments as well um then don't forget to subscribe so you can get like daily clips for me